Welcome to another episode of Deshaun R Show. This episode will feature with Nana and Naruto. Now, I believe that they was apologizing due to what they went through last episode. So, uh, Naruto accompanied Nana and they went on a damn journey. <laughs> a horrible journey that just everything just kept going wrong on the train. He just constantly kept trying to fix it. It looked like Nayumi was able to assist him due to the fact that she is smart. She can look up stuff. She know how to work a computer. While Ayari or Sakurai is just like Takamaya in this particular thing because he was pointing out like you put me on his level. Practice to kill, call him useless or just somebody that's just there. Which is what his character is. This episode completely displayed Nana all throughout it. And Nana is one of my favorite characters due to the fact that she looks like Asana with big boobs. I mean, I just want to say it. She is Asana with big boobs. And she was just all over him too. They killed some of her boobs, killed some of her ass. Just fan service for the fanboys for that character. Or it was a good episode to say the least. And, um,. He in a ridiculous damn position with all them damn girls. I mean, Mari. Mari like him. Noah like him. Narumi. Sakurai. All them girls just like him. And Takamiya, just. Not Takamiya. Uh, Irazumi. Who just in there like. Don't even notice. Like, can one of y'all like him? Damn. I mean, I, I hate. I get entire animes. Would be this one dude with a hero. It happens so many times. It's so cliche. It just never deliver anything new. And at the end, we I know this is the last episode, so this is the finale. Hey, you know, they just let off like they all got a, like off for a week, so who knows exactly what's going to transpire next season if there is a down that season, but. It's annoying. That 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 whole concept is irritating. This uh this lame ass guy managed to get hot girls all over him. It's like a fantasy written by a damn guy that wish he could have a damn badass girls. That's how I feel when I see stuff like that. But overall, it was a pretty nice episode due to um due to Nana. And um, you cannot never get tired of her big ticks. Even though she probably like talking to me uh, as well because she looked directly at him and smiled. She just, the way she looked at him, you could tell she liked him. But anyway, tell you guys think about this. And I give this a 7.5 out of 10, by the way. And make sure you guys rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'm sorry, I'm sleepy as hell, you could tell. <laughs> so have a good one. Peace out.